You're watching Louisiana Living with Ashley Dowdy on Fox 14. And welcome back. It's always a pleasure to have Stuart Hodnett on the air with us. He's with Washita Green here to talk about the Household Hazardous Waste event happening this weekend. And Stuart, great yeah. to have you. And um, yeah. I can't believe it's that time of the year again. It's I know. Just had this. I know. You know, spring comes around real fast. Mm -hmm each year and uh, glad to see the spring. But I love this event because I think about it throughout the year. Um, yeah. We paint the house, we get rid of, you know, some technology. I mean, this is a great event yes. to recycle these type things. It is. So so this Saturday from 9 to 1 here at the uh, Ike Hamilton Expo Center parking lot, we'll be accepting different items that are hazardous to the, to the environment. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's the paints, the latex paints, the oil-based paints. Uh, all the, the poisons, the pesticides, herbicides, mm -hmm. some of the fuels that you have may have water in it, any type of antifreeze, anything like that. A lot of oil, reused oil, we'll take that. And we'll also be taking the standard recycling goods like paper, plastic, uh, aluminum, and cardboard. Uh, we'll be taking those, but also we'll be taking electronics mm -hmm. like TV monitors, uh, computer screens, old printers, old fax machines. Uh, we'll also be taking sharps, needles, uh, only from households. No, uh, you can't take anything from any businesses, but uh, we take okay. some sharps that day. Uh, we'll also be uh, shredding paper documents that you may have around the house. Mm -hmm. Limit three boxes. And um, to keep that out of the, the trash, we'll be re uh, doing that on site. And um, so just come out. Um, and also we'll be accepting tires, up to 20 inch tires in, in size and um, up to limit uh, five uh, per limit per household. That so. is great that you're accepting tires yeah. this year. Yeah. What about prescription medication? Is that a different? Yes. Uh, we'll, no, that, that is this, uh, this weekend. We'll okay. be accepting prescription medication. We're partner, glad to be partnered up with uh, Children's mm -hmm. Coalition this year. Uh, they'll be uh, taking that along with uh, some uh, ULM pharmacy students too. And one great thing that you offer is that you'll help get these, uh, all these items out of the car. So someone can just drive right. up, you can help somebody help you, get somebody to help you load the car from your house, but then you guys will help them unload it at the yeah. event. Yeah, that's a good thing about uh, this event that we got so many volunteers who come out and unload your car with, with you. You don't even have to get out, just, stay, uh, just wait in line. Be patient with us, especially early in the morning because the lines do stack up some. But uh, you, we should be in and out of there by 10 minutes by the time you start rolling. What so. happens to all this waste once you collect it? We recycle it. We're partnered with several partners uh, throughout Louisiana and throughout the nation that will, uh, that will recycle the, everything, electronics and all the pesticides and herbicides mm -hmm. and the paints. So a lot of the paint will stay here. It will go to the local thrift stores, and we'll recycle that back into the community. We have a little bit more time, Stuart. Yeah. Anything else you'd like to mention that I didn't ask you? Yeah, uh, you know, we're, we're taking all those items. Uh, the items that we aren't taking mm -hmm. are like ammunition, okay. uh, fire extinguishers. We are taking fire extinguishers this okay. year. Uh, we're not taking uh, any type of um, um, gas cylinders, any type of compressed gas cylinders like your barbecue grill. We won't be taking any of those. Uh, no radioactive materials. Uh, or smoke detectors uh, or explosives. Okay. None of those things we'll be taking. So right. um, well, just keep everybody safe when we have this, uh, this event on Saturday. Absolutely. And yeah. that's at the Ike Hamilton Center starting at? Starting at 9 a.m. 9 a.m. And we'll go until 1 p.m. All right, Stuart, great. All right. Thanks, thanks for coming on the show and good luck this weekend. Thank you. Still ahead, we're talking about Rustic Community Theater's latest production. You're watching Louisiana Living on Fox Sports. After I got hurt, the insurance company treated